Hey everybody, welcome to Wildcat Guitars. And today we're gonna be choosing our favorite rock and roll relics. So rock and roll relics, a great brand out of uh, Hollywood. Billy Rowe from uh, Buck Cherry and Jet Boy, you know, uh, fame. He's the one who uh, helps design and build these. Uh, he's got a great team over there. I love working with those guys. A lot of great ideas. They always come out better than I expect. Um, my favorite thing about these is they really nail the broken in neck feel. And, you know, everyone really truly feels like it's been played for like 10 years plus. So I really love this brand. And uh, a couple of my favorites, I really like the, the gold top over the Pelham blue. That was sort of, that was one of my ideas, you know, kind of show that uh, how Pelham sometimes it greens, it blues over time, but it was when we did a true color over color. Uh, I really like the sonic blue. You just don't see that color a lot on, on that style of guitar, um, you know. And then also just being a really big fan of blue, I can't leave out the blue Paisley. That, that's a, a really cool guitar. I love P90s. I love the shape of that. And um, let me show you something really cool on the back. I love the Paisley Stinger, right? That just, that's really cool. So, yeah. Those are a few of my favorites. And I'd, I'd be remiss if I didn't, didn't mention the lightning. I mean, changing the F-holes to lightning bolts, that's just uh, super cool and rock and roll all the way, right? What do you think, Mickey? Well, so what I think is we're, since we uh, talked in the first video about what we're doing here, finding our favorite guitar, we're spotlighting the first brand in this series, and Alex has a tough job because he's already picked four out. So I don't envy the position he's in. Um, you know, I have a couple. Um, typically, I would be, this is definitely a favorite for me. Um, I love the filter trons. I love the carved top on the double cutaway. If I were walking in and grabbing one from an aesthetic standpoint, probably grab that one off the wall first and foremost. And green happens to be my favorite color. Um, but uh, the other one that I keep going back to, if I'm just picking it up, um, is this Thunders single cut. Um, I love the slab body like a special. Um, this particular pickup combo with the PAF in the bridge and the P90 in the neck is just stellar. There's so many tones you can get out of this. Um, and uh, I'm a sucker for Burgundy Mist. So, so I don't know at this point which one is going to win out. Um, I kind of have a suspicion I know which one, but uh, uh, I'm going to give it a minute while Alex talks about breaking his down. So. All right, so for me, I'm gonna break this one down purely to aesthetics. Um, and I gotta go with, with my boy Blue, Blue Paisley, the Blue Stinger. I love P90s, I love the wraparound. And uh, yeah, I know I'd, be, I'd definitely stand out on stage. Definitely have the coolest guitar. So that one's gonna be my choice for rock and roll relics. That's a good choice. It's funny, uh, when, the Paisley, when this Paisley series came in, I had my eye on the blue and the green before we got them. And uh, yeah, I, I, that definitely from an aesthetic standpoint, that would be a hard one for me to pass up as well. Um, yeah, you know, it, the more I think about it, the more I realize that if I'm walking in I mean, again, like I said, I love the burgundy mist. I love the tortoise guard on here. I love the fact that they used a piece of tortoise that's got a lot of amber in it. It's just a really, really cool look. But from the standpoint of being able to jump on stage and just do whatever I need to do, this one just can't be beat in my book. So I'm going with the Thunder single cut burgundy mist. And there you go. Pair of Thunders, Blue Stinger, the burgundy mist beauty. So stay tuned for more videos on our favorite guitars from the shop.